Now, I get asked to review a lot of products and to be honest, I turn a lot of them down as I don't think they suit the channel. But this one, I was pretty excited about. This right here is the M-Cube suction laser level that Hoso Design kindly sent me to try out. And this is really cool. Now, it's a lot more than just a laser level and we'll get into that. But the fact it's advertised that it can suction onto any surface could be a game changer for DIYers and especially Tylers like me. So let's check it out. It comes neatly packaged with various accessories. This one here is really good, which I'll show you later. All your basic instructions are in there too. And here's what we're waiting for, the M-Cube itself, with the suction base and module, again, all neatly protected. And these are some of the key specs. Turning it on with a short press on the side, we're greeted by some mounting prompts. A swipe up on the touchscreen will take you to the main menu of the device, where we have quite a few options and settings. And as with most modern tech, this can all be controlled via the app software, which also doubles up as live storage for measurement and project planning. It's way more than just a laser level and you can get different modules and accessories to add if needed. This is another attachment I've got here for finding center points and more suction options if required. So the first thing I was excited to check, and I'm sure you are too, is how well does this thing actually stick? Well, here's a simple test, literally right out of the box. Here is the cardboard lid from what it came in. Let's see if it sticks to that. So turning it on and pressing the button to start the suction, and I couldn't quite believe as quick as that, it is stuck to the cardboard and that is not coming off. So that is pretty impressive. You've got lights on the side here to indicate the suction pressure and it will automatically pump back up if pressure is lost. Another click on the button, the air releases and it's free. So that was a good first test. Now let's take it to site to the bathroom I'm working in. So let's attempt to compare it to my powerful Biwi suction cup I've got here and I'll attempt to stick it to the backboard. As you'll see here, it doesn't hold any pressure at all and I can't get any purchase on it. And just to show, if I move it over to the tile, it sticks and pressures absolutely fine and that is well stuck. And bringing in the M-Cube here, it sticks to the surface once again in seconds, unlike the BWE suction cup and that is unremovable. So press OK once you've got it nice and level and then turn on the laser and away you go. Then you'll get your nice horizontal and vertical green beams. This thing really does stick to anything and as you can see here, no issues on bare plaster at all. So that is a bit of a game changer for tradesmen like me and also perfect for DIYers for hanging pictures and shelves etc. Looking at the functionality here, once you've got it leveled up, you can shoot your green laser beams horizontal and vertical and give it a nice twist and turn to your desired direction. What the top beam is also doing is giving you the distance to what the beam is actually hitting. So like here with the wall on the left being 125.1 centimeters, you can then click the button and lock that measurement straight in. And twisting it back, I can now get the measurement to the ceiling. And again, all these measurements can be stored and sent straight to the app for safekeeping. Also, when you spin the device, it shows you what angle the laser beam is facing. So great for installing things on an angle like handrails on stairs. As mentioned earlier, the module easily removes from the suction cup, which is great for using it for other features. Again, for easily measuring distances or area, you can also select where you're actually measuring it from, the back or the front of the device. Using it for angle finding will also come in very handy. You can see here some of the functions like area, volume, indirect length. It's got you covered for many different scenarios. Now you may think what the laser isn't accurate enough for bigger projects or the lack of a 360 beam could be annoying in some situations. Well, the great thing with this is you can add any laser level you like onto the suction cup base with the AdaptMate attachment that is supplied with it. So you can mount your preferred laser level anywhere easily and quickly. And the bonus, you can stick it to any surface you like, which again makes this very versatile. And there we go, that's my Hooper laser level stuck on there and I now have the 360 beam capability. And considering it's a heavy laser, I still have full suction. So yeah, what a great little device. I feel like everything is covered with this. It's solid and all the attachments snap in magnetically and snugly. USB-C charging, app remote controlled and just generally very versatile. Way too much to cover in this video. So something you'll see me using a lot more of in the future. I'm not adding any affiliate links to this. I just thought it was a cool product to show, but I'll leave a link in the description on where you can find it if you're interested. Thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you in the next one.